What's going on everyone? My name is Glorious Mischief. Welcome back to Little Nightmares. We just got out of the kitchen, and uh, I have I am prone to falling off ledges, as one is wont to do. Ooh, secrets? Mayhaps. I'm gonna just check for secrets. <gasps> it is a secret! Hey buddy, let me give you a hug. That was the easiest secret to find ever, by the way. Love hugging them so fast and easy. Like this. Coolio. Um yeah. So far, I've been loving this game, it, although it has given me about uh, a million heart palpitations, so there you go, there's that. Um, I think that there's a couple things that are a little janky with it. The... ooh, this this perspective shift is, is getting me going, though, I love this. Oh, that was a giant chain. Um, I still feel like this is a ship, am I wrong? Are we on a boat? There's a lot of water. A lot of water. Yeah, the um, the dynamic camera is fun, but it makes it so that you fall a lot when you're on narrow spaces, which is not as fun. Um, so there's that. But other than that, this game has been fun to play. I am on a ship. I'm on a ship. Oh my gosh, I was totally right. And look at all these dudes. Oh, that's cool. Our suspicions were right. Shippage. Shippage. Ooh, so cinematic, dude. Oh, and it gives you the a real sense of scale. So we're on this big giant like cruise ship that all these dudes are going on. There's a big tugboaty thing that's bringing people onto the ship. Oh my gosh, it keeps getting bigger and bigger. Is it a submarine? I don't know, man. It looks a little submarine-y. Look at them all, though. They're so gross. You know that they're going to try to be eating us, too, because I feel like the whole point of this game is like, oh, the, the children are delicious. <laughs> I don't want that. I don't want to be delicious, child. I want to be friendly, child, who's totally safe. Well, they've got masks on, some of them. They're all super fat. This is like Spirited Away. If you've never seen Spirited Away, dude, highly recommend. Like, seriously, I, I will not be offended if you click off. Go watch Spirited Away. Enjoy that movie. It is so good. Um, yeah, it's Studio Ghibli Jam. Studio Ghibli, or Ghibli, Ghibli, whatever you want to call them. Um, their movies are awesome, man. Uh, their animation is super cool. I haven't seen the new one, Boy and the Heron, um, but it's on my to-watch list. And I watch all the other ones because I've got kids, and they love watching Totoro, man. Totoro's their jam, and it was my jam when I was a kid, too. Um, that's one of the coolest parts about uh, being a parent is that you can kind of show your kids what your childhood was, which is awesome. I love doing that. Oh, I almost fell off the edge. Okay. Are there friends down there? Because I don't like to run on the ledges. Because I'll fall off the ledges. Oh, look at them all. I wonder if they... Do I need a side shimmy like a Assassin's Creed? Oh, they don't even notice me. Okay. Look how big they are and gross they are. Oh, man, there she is. There she is. <gasps> oh, no. Whee! Wow, the aesthetics of this game changed so dramatically in this chapter. I'm not complaining, I kind of love it. Ooh, can I peek through? Is there a secret anywhere? Let me check for secrets. Secrets? 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 No secrets. Climb up? No climb up. Yeah, that's fine. Ooh. The ship noises are so cool. Oh, look at all this food. Okay, so I can hide under there. I can to- Oh, shoot. There's people. Am I gonna walk by their little feet? Look at their little feet! Look at their little feet. They're gross. Look at them chomp. So they just are eating raw meat. I'm sniping through. Oh, no. He's coming for me. Oh my gosh, look at him. Oh, please. Don't. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh my gosh, he almost got to me. Oh, he's going again. I don't think he can reach up there. Oh, they're so gross. Is this not the way I was supposed to go? Where am I supposed to go? 
Where? Do I need to climb up these dishes? Oh, no way. That's kind of adorable. <laughs> Look at her. She's so fat. She can't reach me. You're too fat. Oh, I fell. Dude, they, are they wearing masks too? No. Wow, they're very chill about this. This is way less stressful all of a sudden that they're so chill. Okay. Even the scenery behind me looks like Spirited Away, does it not? Seriously. I'll put up a still of Spirited Away next to it. Look how cool that looks. That looks so similar to, like, the little uh, fair that they go to and eat. The parents are eating at. Okay. I'm sliding through the bar. Jeez, they're so gross, though. They are off-putting. I will say that. <laughs> they're little feet. They're just so funny. Oh, my friend. Man, they're just... They eat so much. They're so hungry. Oh, I've got to push it, don't I? Pushed. That was about as easy as it gets. Hey, friend. Let me hug you. Hello. I give hugs. Ugh, oh, I've given so many gosh dang hugs. My hugs are off the chart. What do I need to do, bud? Do I need to leave? Because it seems like these little secret areas, all they are is just little secret zones. I think I need to push. Do I need to push that again? Ooh, do I need to push it up there? And then I need to... Do I need to go across their little place? That's kind of gross. Just to be honest, I don't love that. Can I climb up it now? I'm not even allowed to jump over there. Okay, I am allowed to jump. Here. The girl thing. Okay. We're gonna run. Run, 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 run. Oh! <laughs> okay, I got a little too close to her. Alright, we're back. We're running. <clears throat> I don't think I have to run through that part, though. I think I can just, like, slowly walk as long as I avoid their hands. So... Hands. They also take a second to grab. Can I stab them? Oh! You, got, you really gotta be perfect with this little trick. Won't let me pick up the knife. Wanted to pick up the knife. Let's run through town. Okay, creepy gal. Here we go. So, lunge. Lunge. Perfect. Okay, we made it. We made it. Don't make me do that again, please. Thank you. Ugh. Creepy dudes. Creepy duders. It really is. It's funny. It really, really, really is starting to feel so much like Spirited Away. Which is funny. I wasn't expecting this game to get so analogous with that. You know? Ooh, look at this big boy. Eats the fish. Do I need to go over this? Seems like I do. Here's my little guy. Oh, he's coming. <laughs> They're just so fat. They can't do much. <laughs> the music is way more intense than it needs to be. And we're through. Where's my little friend? Where'd he go? Oh. Nope, 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 Elusive. Do I need to jump over him? That's hilarious. I did have to jump over him. Get away from me, brother. I'm gonna slide. Oh, I'm not gonna slide. Indiana Jones into the wall, baby. <laughs> uh, whoops. 
Okay, so we know what we need to do. You fall off your chair. Come on over. Come on over, baby. Oh, I'm a delicious morsel that you wanted to snack upon. And then I leave. Oh, he's on me. How was he on me so fast that time? And Indiana Jones for reals this time. Yeah, how do you like that? Sneak attacks. Oh, sneak. Treasure. Oh, fudge bars. He's right here. Okay, that is a that is a that is a secret. I don't know how I can get to it though. I'm hiding in here. He closes the door behind him. I'm not gonna get to that treasure. I wanted the treasure. Okay. Oh! He opened the door back up. Oh, and he closed the door again. That wasn't very nice of him. Where do I go? I don't trust the mirror for some reason. Should I trust the mirror? Am I in the mirror? I'm in the mirror. Hmm. I can't open the door. So what do I do? What is a man to do? Climb upon the bathrooms. Hmm. Can I turn anything on? Can I grab this toilet paper and throw it at anything? No. Distinctly. Oh, can I break the mirror? <gasps> I can break the mirror. That's so creepy. It's a, a one-way mirror or a two-way mirror. So literally someone's just sitting there watching those people go to the bathroom? This, this game is creepy, dude. Ooh. No thanks, dude. Especially with how gross these things are. Come on, man. Not that there's any excuse ever. Let's be honest. There's never an excuse to be watching someone doing that stuff. But creepy. Oh. That man is... is oh. I fell. <laughs> That man was whacking something, and I was paying too much attention to his whacks instead of what I'm supposed to do. Okay, well, at least I know what to do now. Run, 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 run. Don't even look at me. What if he, what if he never notices me? Do I have to hide? I'm guessing he still is chasing me. Yeah. It still is triggered, even if it doesn't, um, it doesn't show that he's chasing you. Do with that what you will. And he leaves. Such a slammer. Such a slamming man. And hey. Yowie. I missed. Sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry, missed again. And <laughs> Got it. Still creepy and gross. Still gross and creepy. Okay, we're climbing up. And we're through! Yeah, I wonder, um... I haven't seen any interviews, obviously, of the people who made this game. Because I really don't know anything about this game. But I wonder how much they were, um... Inspired by Spirited Away. Because it really feels so similar to that. Okay, I'm gonna go down there and grab that, because I need the secret in my life. That's... The kind of man that I am. I'm a secret man. And... <laughs> Don't come running at me. Oh, he's coming. I feel like once they hear the elevators, they get a little nervous. Or do they not care? I heard I heard a little noise. <gasps> like this? What's up here? A secret? No. There's nothing. Okay, so there's... that's that. Wait a second. Yeah. Oh. A hugs. Hug. Is he... <laughs> is he trying to make him pee? That's what he's trying to do. He put his hand in hot water. He's trying to make him pee. That's funny. You're funny, dude. I dig what you're doing. Keep up the good work, brother. Prank those homies. Oh shoot. Okay. You guys just you guys are just a mass of bodies. I really don't love that. 
No, 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 no. Okay, I'm running. I'm running. And Indiana Jones in. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Leap over that. Okay. Oh man, this is so gross. I kind of love it though. Okay, give him some things to... Oh, I've got to jump over that. Oh, and this guy's right here. Don't grab me. Don't grab me. Oh, they're getting so close. Keep running, baby. Are they going to fall? <laughs> One of them did. Oh, that was sick. Oh, wait a second. Is that the dude's hat? Is that his hat? Long arm dude, is he back? That's his hat. That looks a lot like his hat at the very least. Oh, I'm hungry again. Please don't eat my, my family. Run, run, run. Why am I so hungry all the time? Also, I didn't even finish that half a rat that I had downstairs. I should have finished the rat. But something's going on with my hunger. Where whenever I'm hungry, the lights all flicker. What is that symbolic of? I'm hungry. Let me come get a snack. <gasps> Are you gonna give me a sausage? Can I have it? Let me eat that sausage. Oh no! 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 Oh man! That's, that's so mean! I've been waiting this whole game. Can I at least eat the sausage now? <laughs> I can pick it up. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. Can I pick you up and bury you? Oh man. I've been spending this whole game collecting those dudes and hugging them. And then you're going to make me eat them when he was handing me a delicious sausage? Clearly, I've been friends with them. Okay. Well, you you shut me up real quick, man. Hold on. There's secrets this way. I can feel it in my bones. My bones were correct in feelings. I hate the fact that I had to eat him. I wish there was something I could do to make it so I didn't have to eat him, you know? Like if I collected enough of them, could I not eat him? Target acquired. Can I hide? Do I need to hide? Hiding gear. I didn't need to hide. I don't I don't think I need to bring a can either. Little fox among hungry wolves. Great! I made it through that. Lord have mercy, man. So stressful in there. Oh sorry, I gotta crack the back. Oh. Okay, I thought it was a cutscene. You did a good job with that. Oh, she's creepy. Oh, she's creepy. Okay, so there's all these mannequins. Great, another key. Can't wait to find this key. I wonder where it's going to be. Right underneath the boss? Sounds about right. My heart is was just pounding down there. That's what this game does. It gives you this little, like, vibration. Oh, no. She's right there. Do I do I really need to get close to her? The shattered mirror? There's one of the dolls. Am I breaking her dolls every time I do it? Oh no. She's gonna be a nightmare, I bet. At least she's not as grotesque as the other ones, but I bet she's gonna like give me all the problems. Do I need to break her urn? That's where I'd put my key if I was her. In an urn in a very well-lit area. Push it. And then run. She went silent. And is she gone? Okay. I got the key. I'm hidden. I'm under the bed. <laughs> Where is she? She's gone. And there is a treasure up there. I want the treasure. 
Give me the treasure. Fuck the treasure. Nice. Wouldn't it be great if all those treasures were just making her less powerful? I'd love that. So I didn't have to deal with so many dang problems. She's a tiny guy. Girl? Guy. Girl? Tiny guy girl. <laughs> just looking for freedom. Just trying to get off this dang ship. That key was very easy. And I find it a little disconcerting how easy that was. There's mirrors in here, which means she's in here somewhere. Oh. I hate that. There she is. That's her. That's her. That's her. We're running. Slide. Okay. She doesn't... She doesn't have legs. She just floats. Okay. Okay. There's more mirrors. Love that. Is that her again? No, the lights are going to turn on. Okay. My the controller is 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 vibrating aggressively, by the way, which makes me very aware that she's here somewhere. I have no idea where. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. That is an eyeball. For sure. Okay. I'm just a hidden, hidden boy girl. Looking for the way home, baby. No one needs to chase me. Because there's nothing important going on. I can climb up that. Can't I? Nope, I can't. What am I supposed to do here? What? Okay, pull it off. Great. And we're through. Uh, is this of any importance? Nope. Oh, wait a second. It is important. Pick it up. Can I scare her with the mirror? No. She's broken all the mirrors. So this clearly is the way to beat her. I have to do something? Do I have to show her her face? That would be freaking cool. There she is. Is that what I have to do? I'm gonna walk up to her. This is a mistake. This is a mistake. I'm in the dark. No? Okay. Oh. I didn't like that. <laughs> I didn't like that at all. I think I need to stay in the light with the mirror. That's, that's my current hypothesis. Current hypothesis. Stay in the light with a mirror. And then be really, really nice to everyone. <laughs> And don't eat my friends anymore. Okay. She's gone. She's so gone. Stay in the light. Stay in the light. There she is. Oh, I'm sucking you up, baby. Okay, get the mirror, please. Can we get up? We gotta stay in the light. Where's the light? Where is it? Where's the light? There it is. Okay. I am having a boss encounter. Where are you? There she is. Okay. Get back up. A rule of threes in video games, right? The next one's gonna be the one where she gets trapped in the mirror. Pick it up. Run, 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 run. There it is. Okay. Where are you coming from, baby girl? From this way? From this way. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Oh, lordy, lordy. Oh, she's there. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, I'm- I'm- I should be- I should be sucking you in. Gotcha, gotcha! Okay. Can I get- that was three. That seems like it should be enough. The lights? Lights right here. Hey. 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 We're rotating and we're ready for you. Oh yeah, baby girl. You don't stand a chance. My mirror's so good. Okay. Where you at? Where you at? Where are you coming? Where are you coming from? There she is. Ooh. <laughs> get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Pick it up. Where is she coming from? 
Oh, again. Okay. Get up, little guy. Come on. Mirror. Where are you coming from? There you are. I broke the mirror. But she screamed. Broke, but scream. She's on the ground. Oh, no. Oh, am I going to eat her? I'm hungry. Oh, and she's looking mighty delicious. <laughs> oh, look at that almond hair. She looks like the girl from the ring. It's time to go chomp on her. Time to just feast upon her. Why are we so hungry all the time? The most inopportune times. Hello. I eat. <laughs> and do I become a horrible monster? Okay, I feasted upon her. Oh. Is that blackness going into me? I am becoming an evil monster. Do I get to have a really cool moment where I get to kill everything that was chasing me? That would be kind of fun. Oh no, I'm just going to be scary. <laughs> okay. So I ate her and took her power? Or just like took her like ghostly nastiness? Ooh. Okay. Creepy. Okay. I have powers now. The lights all go out with me. Oh, no way. I just get to walk amongst them now. And I, few I short out all the lights. They see me. Oh. I just suck the life out of them? Oh, I'm so creepy. Now I am the creepy ones. Come on, baby. Let me get some of that sweet, sweet snacks. Oh, man. So some of them wear masks. Not all of them. Am I getting out of here? I'm just sucking them all up. Yeah, dude. <laughs> That's right. I'm <laughs> full Rorschach moment. I'm not stuck in here with you. You're stuck in here with me. <laughs> so now I'm not stuck in here anymore. I guess. Am I leaving the ship? Am I just going to like lay waste to the world at large? With my yellow poncho of doom. I'm out. That's sunlight, as far as I'm concerned. Dude. Creepy game. A storm is coming. That coach should come useful. The ladies' quarters. Mm. That's cool that they gave you a boss fight in there. I really wasn't expecting there to be a boss fight mechanic. At all. Like, I was expecting it to be some semblance of something like that. Like, you had to have some moment. Ooh! Are these my friends? Are those all the ones I saved? I saved a bunch of them. Oh, wow, they seamlessly did a cutscene because I can't move anymore. There you go. I don't know what the Mushroom Head dudes are. But they're cute. And I ate one of them. And I didn't mean to. Oh, wow. That was a quick and, and, and um, straightforward game. So, let's go over a few things. One, the mood in this game. Super cool. I love the art style with it and the fact that um, you get little snippets here and there. Like the fact that the cook is a um, is like wearing a mask. That's really cool. I love that you get to cut off that dude's arms. That's really rewarding. It's nice that not every single like big boss or like big enemy is something that you have to defeat. Some of them are just things that you have to like work around, like the cooks. Um, their environmental storytelling was super cool. I love that the secrets 
that you went to find are actually showing you more of the world. I think that's all really tastefully done. And I think that, um, at the end, having that, like, big power spike moment where, like, yeah, now I get to do all that stuff is really cool. Um, it's similar to, um, Shadow of the Colossus, where you get to have that little power spike at the end, which is really fun. Qualms with the game. Uh, I've got a couple. Not a ton, but a couple. One, the loading times or loading screen uh, setbacks are super long. So you'll get to a puzzle, you'll get your way up there, and then you'll fall, and you'll have to go all the way back, and it'll take you a couple minutes. Keep in mind, that wouldn't be such a big issue if it wasn't for the fact that their three-dimensional space is a little bit wonky. Like, it would be nice if there was a little bit more, like, um magneting in the game where you don't have to be such so direct with your platforming i feel like that combined with the fact that the loading uh or like the the save spots are so uh far apart it just makes it so that you kind of feel like uh well i feel like i'm wasting my time a lot in that game um that being said i think that this this full game is like three hours so you know come on man can't complain too much um, but I think that each boss was really cool. I thought the mechanics were really cool. I think, honestly, Long Arms Dude was by far the creepiest to me. Just probably because we spend the most time with him. Um, you really get to spend like an hour with him. And you also get the biggest payoff because you get to cut off his arms. And that's awesome. Like, that is actually a really fun payoff to that. Um, the, the cooks, I thought that their, like, design was cool. And the fact that they're like these two twins who are creepy and they're like doing all this stuff and all that goodness. I thought that was cool. Um, I think that they did a really, really, really good job making the world feel as creepy as it is. I feel like a lot of like dark games, they make it so that it feels creepy, but like the, um, the actual actions of the characters, not that creepy. Um, in this one, it felt like everything about the characters and their environment was creepy. Like the fact that we were in that bathroom and then we break the window. And there's just a chair on the other side of it, looking through the mirror. Like, perfect usage of, like, subtle creep, right? Um, and then Long Arms Dude, he's by far, like, the creepiest. He comes after you the most, and I feel like his, just his mechanics all feel way creepier than any other bosses in there. Um, so it's nice to have the fact that, like, that payoff of, like, oh, I actually get to defeat that boss. Instead of just being like, oh, okay, like, I escaped the boss, and everything else is still going. Like, it's nice that you leave the ship, and it feels like you've you've made a difference in that space. Like, the mushroom dudes are going to leave, even though you eat one, which is brutal, by the way. Like, you spend the whole game saving them, and then just eat one, which it breaks your heart, dude. But once again, it, like, paints the picture of this, like, super dark and creepy space that I kind of love, man. Um... So yeah, if you're looking for a really nice spooky game that's like not too spooky, because let's be real, like there's no jump scares there. It's all just creepy ambiance. Um, if you're looking for a nice spooky game that's got some platform elements as well as like a little bit of um, of cool boss design and boss mechanics that aren't just like okay, hit them a couple times and you'll get through it. It's a, honestly a great game. I, I I would play this game again, and I probably will play this game again. Um, but it's just so fun to get to play a game for the first time with you guys. Because I never get that experience, really. Because um, I've played so many games in the past. So it's really nice to just kind of get through it. And yeah, obviously Bandai Namco. Having Bandai Namco behind you on a game is great. Um, but I do know that the team that made this game was pretty small. And I think that's kind of awesome. That you've got this smaller team that comes together to build something that's so creative and so interesting. I love it, man. I think that's super cool. And I think that when you get games that are made from people who are passionate, you can really tell. Like, the music in this wasn't anything particularly, like, ravishing, but it was spooky. It was spooky in all the right points. Um, yeah. I think other than a little bit of, like, weird pathing mechanics, like the jumping mechanics I talked about previously, as well as some of the bosses, like, clinging to you in a weird way. Um, I honestly don't think that this game was half bad. It's pretty great. <sighs> and I really, really, really 
am going to enjoy spooky season. And I hope you guys are too. I don't know what your plans are. I'm going to be trick-or-treating with my kiddos, and it's going to be awesome. Uh, but yeah, if you're looking for a sneaky, spooky game that you can get behind, feel a little tiny, don't get to feel that very often, man. Uh, this game is totally worth your time. Ooh! Wait a second! I'm on a little island! Oh, I love that! The island's moving? I don't get that. That's cute! Oh, That's really cute! I love that! Cool! <laughs> Distant Foghorn? Am I like a, a, the lighthouse manager now? Is that what I do? I manage the lighthouse. Ah <laughs> oh, man, that game was fun. Well, thank you guys so much for coming along with me. I really appreciate it. This has been a blast and I've really loved this game. Uh, so yeah, happy Halloween and happy spooky season and I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace! Cause I'm coming in hot Let's eat some biscuits Let's get close